We are holding down the fortress today, bruv. You get me? Kojo won't be around for the next couple of weeks and that, bruv. Kojo is going camping. He got me. He's going camping. <laughs> you get me? Listen, make it a go fight down for GH, bruv. <laughs> My man is going GH and that, bruv. You get me? Yeah. Listen, bro. I am here to have a good time. I don't know about you. Bro, but I don't know if the cold is going to let me, you know. Bro, bro, bro. Listen, fam. As long as I'm inside, bruv. As long as the heat in the zone, bruv. I'm good. Nah, you, get the heat on, you have your heating on the whole time. Not the whole time though, but but like a couple hours in the day still. Yeah, nah. The you got I me, mean, guy. I not gonna lie. I want to do some Superman before, but but the coach showed me. Do you want to do? He <laughs> gave me. I said, nah, no, no hitting right now for the lie, lie, <laughs> guy. <laughs> your, your balls go freeze. They bro. go freeze, bro. You get me. But listen, fam. I just need to have a good time for right now, bro. You get me. So I start, was start it right. Start it right then. Start I'm gonna it start right. it right. Yeah. I'm gonna start it the best way. Listen, since we started this podcast, yeah, mm. and I'm not gassing anyone up, yeah. This is the best way I'm gonna start this. Is it? You get me. Hmm. One of our listeners in that, yeah? Yeah. Hit me up yeah. within the week and say, yo, G, mm. can you blast my thing on your podcast still? Mm. Yeah. You know one of them ones in this. So I said, all right, cool. Send send it through. He was like, um, how much are you charging me? I said, nah, bro. We're not charging you nothing. You get me? Send it through. Yeah. We are doing our bits for the culture and that. Yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? And my man for it was a joke, bro. He sent it through, man. I listened to the thing, bro. I just kept quiet the whole week because... I want make when I listen to him on the podcast too, fam. Yeah, yeah, because I'm like, what is this? this is breaking news, bro. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. This is Ice Beat Chills. Now the guy name yeah, No yeah. laugh, no laugh, no laugh. No, 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 no. Now nah. I'm named now. All right, all right, cool. <laughs> <laughs> Ice Beat Chills shout with out, the song. Shout out, Ice Beat Chills. You, you got me. Salute to you, my G. You know what I'm saying? Let, let me, I want to hear this. Now, nah, with the song, Super you've, Woman. You've bro. gassed it up to I'm man. gassing wanna, it up right hear, now, bro. I want to hear it now. I'm gassing it up right now, bro. Ice. Ice. Yes, this is Ice Beat Chills. Super Woman. Hey. You know what, bro? Yeah. I asked them. Yeah. I said, yo, can we play this on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up, yeah. With the copyright with the business. whole copyright thing. Can we play this on YouTube and that? Yeah? He said, Yeah, feel free. I said, because if we can't play it on YouTube, then I'm gonna have to play as a sleeper. Mm -mm. But if we can play it on YouTube, then we'll play it on the podcast. He said, Yeah, you can play it on YouTube. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And for all you man out there, yeah, sending your songs and everything. We are here for the up and coming. Yep, yep. Fuck, fuck, fuck the 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 guys that have been around. <laughs> You know what I'm nah, saying? No, 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 nah, 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 bro. Don't we are no here for the up and coming, bro. We are here for the culture. Because yeah, the yeah. TV said the guys that have been around, you know, they go one see the numbers where your podcast they get to know if they go yeah, one fuck with your podcast yeah, and that. Yeah, nah, we are here for the culture, bro. You get me? So if you're an artist, if you're an up and coming artist, yeah, sending your shit to Fresh Off the Boat Podcast, mm -hmm. yeah, or Fresh Off the Boat Pod on Instagram, or you can slide into my shit, Steel, Steel Tobes, S T I W -L, L. T O B Z on Instagram, or you can slide into Kelly Mishgaga on yeah, Instagram on too. Instagram. It's right there. Feel on, free, feel yeah, free. Yeah, yeah, it's right there on the screen, man. So, bro, enough talking, man. Let's back this tune, nah, bro. Nah, let's, let's listen to this. Ice, ice, ice beat, chills. The name of the song is Superwoman, bro. You get me? Hey. Listen, fam, I'm playing this at the end. <laughs> you got me. Yeah. I'm, no, 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 bro. I'm running up the numbers for my man, bro. You get me? I'm running up. You get me? Like, like to me, I want support people like this. You get me? I want me to support people like this and everything. You get me? I know some people they look all the whiskey and that be those and all that shit. Okay, yeah, it's cool and that and everything, man. You get me? But there are also some, yeah, some new guys that are coming up and that, bro. You get me? So go check out this song, Superwoman by Ice Beat Chills on all your digital platforms, bro. You get me? Don't show yourself, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! Oh, it's a tune, though. 
Nah, 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 he's cool though. Yo, you're welcome to Fresh of the Boat Podcast. You get me? This is where the party happens every week. You can be anywhere in the world, but you're right here with us. You can be in Niger, you can be in Ghana, you can be in Kumas, you can be in South Africa, you can be in the UK, you can be in America, wherever you are, man. Salute to you, man, for real. Mm. So. Go check out this guy's song, man. It's everywhere. On YouTube, on Spotify, on Apple Podcasts, man, for real. Or rather, Apple Music. Eyes be chill. Superwoman. And you know what, though? Yeah. All you young all you young guys and everything, and also young ladies as well, up and coming artists, if you're in the UK, hit us up and everything. If you want to come on the podcast, we can jam your tunes. Can get to know you and everything and, and and help promote your song man you get me because this is what the culture is about still you get me helping each other grow man for real yeah yo fam like y'all keeping quiet well, what do you think about the tune yeah, 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 you're familiar. Well, them ones where you got to listen to. Yeah, yeah, I hear that still. <laughs> yes, sir. That was a jam, bro. That was a jam, bro. <laughs> the life of the party. party. Yo, you fam. Anybody. <laughs> have you met that kind of girl beef he felt like this when one once she walks in like this, everywhere she, just she takes up. the life away, bro. Yeah, bro. Nah, but those them me. kind of girls are jarring because most of them, most of them, they feel like they're 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 flipping yeah. Naomi Campbell. Bro. I don't like when your ego is too much. Nah, yeah. bro. I like I, I like more, that. More love, less ego. Nah, nah, nah. That's a myth, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that is a myth, bro. We have concluded that that is a myth. You guys say, uh, make a little believe that one, bro. But shout out to shout Chill. Out to I- Ice Beat Chills. Yeah, bro. Ice, Ice Beat Chills, Chills, man. Superwoman. Go check it out anywhere on your audio platforms, on YouTube. You go, I mean, salute to you, my guy. Keep doing your thing. Keep doing you your go, shit. You go, I'm saying, keep doing your thing and we will keep on supporting you. Yep. If you release some new shit, send it through. And then also, you man out there as well, if you release some new shit, if you got some new shit in the talk, send it through as well, man. We are here to support the culture and everything and do our own little bit. You get me? But once... While we are on the supporting tip and that, yeah? If you're watching this video and you've not subscribed to the channel on YouTube, do that Fresh Off The Boat podcast. You go, I mean? Please and do. You're meant to say please, by guy. I, I didn't hear you say please. No, 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 bro. I'm not begging them, fam. <laughs> you get me? <laughs> but it's cut no, 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 no. Because, no, 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 nah, nah, bro. Because if they're not subscribing, they're the one missing out, fam. You go, I'm saying? You go, I mean, you're, you're the one missing out, bro. You get me? You get me? their loss. Yeah, 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 bro. It's your loss, man. You get me? Or also, you can go on the audio platforms as well on Spotify. Apple Podcasts, Amazon, Google Podcasts, wherever you're listening um, to, to this podcast then. Yeah, Fresh of the Boat Podcast. Catch up on all the episodes. Share them. Um, like them. Leave a comment. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Or tell an enemy to tell a friend. Because they got friends too. Each you and know every what I'm one saying? of them, my guy. And just like we always say, anything where you hear for here, anything where you hear about us, nah, true. Not true, not true. You go, I mean, we know the debate and we anyone, <laughs> bruv. You get me? No it, arguments. No, no arguments, bruv. <laughs> you get me? And like I always say, man, we are getting bigger and bigger and bigger and you know, you know bigger. What? That, this, this, this is gro- it's growing on me now, bro. It's growing on me still. Nah, for real, though. For real, for real. You got me. So salute to all you guys out there, yeah. man. You know, and then also, just before we go on, man, um, Davido. Yeah. Apparently, he will be performing at the World Cup, innit? Yeah, the closing ceremony. Bro. Yeah, he'll yeah, be yeah, yeah. yeah, he'll be performing and everything. So it's salute con- to it's my confirmed, man. confirmed, innit? Yeah, He's it's confirmed and everything. Yeah. I think I saw a clip on the internet where um, if I, he was going into the plane or something. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, so salute to him and everything. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, he's been through um, a situation, you know. Been, and, been and through the yeah, storm. 
you know, an unfortunate situation and everything. So salute to him, salute to his girl, the family and everything, man. We are praying for you, man. God. Yeah. Sending you, you sending love from this way, bro. Yeah, for real, for real. It's for all real. love. All love, man. Yeah. All love. So fam, mm. should we get into the bullshit, man? What bullshit? Let's bullshit, get... man. <laughs> <laughs> bullshit, man. <laughs> because a lot of bullshit have been happening this week, man. For yeah. real. But before we start, bro, I'm just going to... Should we be trying this. to get Brittany Griner back? Should we be? Hell no. They got niggas locked up right here need to get out of jail for some cannabis weed. I wouldn't give a fuck what it do for you. We say it's illegal over here in Russia, bitch. You, you ain't just packed this shit up. You been sneaking it back through here, and we already know you have that. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. We know yes, this sir. war was coming, and you done got caught up and fucked up. And I think the American government is wrong in the motherfucker for going over there trying to save that bitch. Let her do her motherfucking time. So let her kneel in the ass, stay over there, and see if the LGBT community can go get her. But we don't need to be wasting our goddamn government's time. Yeah, they can be getting a real motherfucker that deserve to be. I'm all about the real. jokes today, bro. I'm all about, about the banter today, bro. So if you're sensitive, they need to be getting the right that's been over there since 2018. They say he a Russian spy, but he really ain't. And they done exchange this crazy motherfucker that's been selling. Man, he go, we go put America back in jeopardy again for a basketball bitch that won't even stand for the national anthem. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So they toss it now because of Ibo Abi. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> now, but okay. <laughs> Shayo. Ibo. Ibo. <laughs> hey. I know go fee take it so to I like Dabo My love I know holy My ayo Long cry yo I need the bo and sha yo sha yo Yes sir yes sir yes sir Bro, I'm here for the jokes. I'm here for the laughs. Salute to Brittany Griner too. Nah. But listen, anyone can get it today, man. <laughs> be careful, my guy. <laughs> anyone can you get it, bro. You better be careful, <laughs> man. You get me? Yes, sir. 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 Yeah, man. Listen. Brittany Griner, obviously, was he on Thursday? Yeah. I was at work. I look up to the TV because we have this massive TV in the office and that, you get me? I look up. Britney Griner, breaking news on CNN. Psh, Britney Griner's coming home. I said, hi, hey, is this real? Check it. Yeah, it's real. Okay, who are we swapping for? M-O-D. <laughs> no, wait, wait, no. That much Bro, up there. M-O-D. <laughs> The merchant of death. <laughs> Fam, the first thing that came to my mind was America just traded LeBron James for Chris Humphreys, bruv. You know who Chris Humphreys is? Nah, it's, uh, it's not up to LeBron James standard, isn't it? I'm sure he's doing his thing. Man, man. Man. <laughs> <laughs> you get me? In football terms, yeah, Manchester United just traded Cristiano Ronaldo for... For for some somebody in the championship, bruv. You get me? Yeah, no, nah, but it depends. No, okay, not but, really though. It depends though. The way you look at it. it. Nah, bro. Say okay, cool. Now, apart from the jokes, because jokes is gonna fly. Yeah, I understand. If I was Britney Griner, mm. I don't give a shit. Yeah. If yo trade anybody, I'm I wanna come home. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? If I'm her partner, salute to her partner. Yeah. Trade anybody. I want my partner to come home. Mm. If I'm her family, fr uh, um, her family member, trade anybody. I don't yeah. give a shit about the whole marine talk and soldier. Nobody get, give a shit about our soldier anyways before now. If we're gonna be honest. Oh, which one? The Wheelan guy. The, the Wheelan guy. guy. No one was talking about him. You know what I'm saying? He's, he's been there too. You know. Yeah. 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 He's, he's been, been there for time, but no one yeah. was talking about him. Yeah. You get me? Trump tried to get him out. 
but then you know Russia, Russia was like ladder. Yeah, they so, need to exchange, you know. So from a moral, personal point of view, if that was someone that I know personally, of course I wanted to come back. But if we are looking at it from a political islands, rah, America got ripped off. No, they, they, I mean it depends on what side. Because like, <laughs> B- B- Negrana is of is I mean it's like she was up there. People wanted her to come back home. Fab, she's a basketballer. Yeah, yo, no, yo, you is. are talking about the merchants of death. No, Do yeah. I need to read out this guy's no, resume, no, fam? No, but arms dealer. Yeah, he's an arms dealer. So fam, not, uh, fam, do you know what this guy did in Africa? What did he do? He sold arms to people that wanted to buy arms, didn't he? It's not people, there, it's, th- yo, child soldiers and everything, though. Yeah, but he's not the one personally giving them the arms, though. He's the one like, that's all supplying them, though. Yeah, it's it's just like a right, like say you've got a product now, you're selling phones, beam. Yeah, talk and, to and, then, and then and then okay, say the phones now is for po- pornographic phones. Like you, <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, you, you yeah. only see pawns on the phone. All right, right. And then you, that's what you sell, isn't it? And then some a grown ass man is coming to say, okay, we won't buy this phone of 3,000 phones. Yeah. Do you think you care about who's going to be using the phone? Of course. No, 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 no. See, you no, don't. No, 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 so, no, 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 no. Of course, we are both from the streets, right? That, yeah, yeah. That's like saying, yo, I'm on the streets, I'm selling drugs and everything, and the street want what they want. I supply, supply and demand. Yeah. I, I understand that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But yeah, then yeah, yeah. When, when, you, when you now start peeling it all the way down, yeah, you now realize from a moral standpoint. Yeah, my mom was fucking. My my, my mom was doing some terrible shit. He, when you look at the consequences of his actions, yeah, yeah, yeah. you get know what I'm saying. No, I'm not. I'm not like, I'm not in support of war, you know. But at the end of the day, that's the that's the name of the game. People that, will no, always no, sell those arms. Bro, that is the name of the game. That's the name of the game. But my thing is this situation, no. This situation, anyway. Even though I didn't want to make this situation very serious, I wanted to just have a laugh, mm-hmm. right? It's not like an either or yeah. it's not a, a situation of which one is better mm-hmm. you get what i'm saying ideally yes yeah. um flipping britney griner and willan would have come back home but russia was not having it yeah, and I'm the fin- and the thing is yeah th- this whole thing that's been going on this plus the jews plus hitler and all those things yeah it has opened my eyes because I will tell you this, bro. I'm an outsider. Yeah? Meaning, meaning this is where I'm coming from. I was not born over here. I wasn't born in the West. Yeah. Right? So, so I was not programmed. Right? I wasn't programmed from growing up to tell you this is it, this is it, this is it. Right? Because I was having that conversation with a couple of my friends. Um, within the week and that, right? And I said something. Once again, it's not either or, right? We live in a society where somebody can actually, someone can say, I love Satan. I love the devil. And nobody will, will nobody will share. Everybody will be like, all right, cool, whatever, right? Mm. But if you say, I like so-so guy, Hey, you can't say that. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. To me, where we, where we come from, back home, Satan is the worst. Mm-mm. Right? Satan is the worst. Like, if someone beside me says, I love Satan, I'm going to be like, yo. Like, me, <coughs> me yeah. self, I'm going to look at you like, yo, are you all right? Yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? Which is where, which is where I'm coming from about the whole, people have been programmed to think this way. You get what I'm saying? So someone like us that came from outside the system into the system is more of a culture um, culture shock. That what? You get what I'm saying? I did not even really know about my man, right? Mm. Until we came over here. Yes, yes. Back in Africa, you go hear the name. Yeah, yeah I mean, in school. You, yeah. In school, you go yeah. hear the name. But we knew more about what our own people went through. Colonization. Mm-mm-mm. You know what I'm saying? We knew more of what um, King Leopold and them lot were doing. Did in Congo because it affected us directly. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now, coming over here, it feels like, nah, mate, 
you guys' story not really matter like that. This is the one here. You get me? So, so to be like, you get what I'm saying? So, with this whole thing that I've been going on, I've gone back and now started like reading, bro. I've been reading on different shit, bro. I've been reading on different stuff. And then one of the things that I read was the Merchant of Death. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And what he done. What, what he's done. Yeah. yeah. And then also I had to watch um this film as well, The God of War, by um by Nicolas Cage. Oh, that one with the arms dealer is there. Was it it's was him? It him? Oh, it's, okay, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. It's, it's based on my man. You get me? So my point is. I understand, as in, she's an American citizen, da 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 you go, I mean, it's good that she came back to her family, because when you look at, a lot of things in this situation can be true, right? And few, and few, 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 um, free to, to chime in, um, okay, cool, they said that she had a vape, right? The punishment for the vape, we all can agree. A bit excessive. It's, it's a bit excessive. No, but it's it's weed vape though. It's not just normal your 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 normal me and you vape. Yeah, <laughs> it's a big boy vape, bro. Yeah. <laughs> it's big man vape, yeah. <laughs> big boy vape. So you know, that carries the same because it's like I mean, if they're saying weed is not uh, illegal there, then if you get any product from weed, then it's illegal, isn't it? You're facing the same charge. Yeah, but so but, but then but then to tell you why this place where we they don't spoil us here, we they look I'm like it's not a big deal. But over there, it in their law, yeah. it is a big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we are making our assessments from this side of the world, mm. which a lot of people in the West need to understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not how the world no, works. It doesn't apply everywhere. It doesn't apply everywhere. And sometimes when I try to tell people this, they think, they think that maybe I'm not being, um, you know... The feelings and the um, empathy and other shit is not there. But I'm telling you guys the facts. Mm -hmm. Because back home in Nigeria, we do not give a shit about, <laughs> about the whole thing about um, Holocaust. He's, we, 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 they just care. Don't, they we mean, don't. Yeah, yeah. To an extent, yeah. Because it's not It wasn't a thing back, yeah. back in Nigeria. It's not in discussion. It's discussion. No. Yeah, we only don't. started paying attention to that when we came over here. Mm. You mm -hmm. get know what I'm saying? So when I tell people, bro, I've lived on two sides of the fences and I can tell you what you think is not a big deal here. When you do it in some countries, you will die for it. Yeah, definitely. You get you know what I'm saying? Like, that is a fact. No, no, no. Especially with this uh, Britney one. It's like, well, but then again, I get people saying, yeah, she's not really what who you're going to be ex swapping with the merchant of debt or whatever. But at the end I, of the I, day... Yeah, but when, I think some of that as well comes from a bit of a racism sort of thing because she's a black black woman. No, but even with that, when she... I remember when she got fair arrested. Like, that's like a normal crime where you get arrested and you go do the time. But the buzz, there was a buzz. Mm. Even I remember back then, I'm thinking, yo, this girl got caught with this thing. Why are we... Why is it on the news everywhere? Like, yeah, but, but that's part of because it's Russia as well. Exactly. So he paid he played into Russia's hands because you're trying to demonize Russia to say, yo, 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 you're doing this because of that. And I said, Oh, okay, really? So this is like this is a high value person for you lot. Then mm. all right then. If you want her back, we want my man Victor. Yeah. What's his name? Victor Blow, whoever his name is. Boot. <laughs> <laughs> M O D. Yeah, exactly. So 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 I just think because we made it that Force about the whole Britney Grand she don't. I don't think it's we. I think it's Americans. Yeah, but I mean, we're saying we obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not me and you. Bro. Yeah, I don't. bro, bro, listen, bro. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna like, give you. Sometimes when I see that, yeah, I look at America as a reality TV show. You yeah, get me? Yeah, I'm just on the side, just just watching them. No, but it's a it's a it's comedy show, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, it's a disaster over there. You get me? And and it's just one of them ones, right? I'm fortunate enough. To come from where where I come from because I'm looking at it from the outside, looking mm. in, mm -mm. yeah, and and I can tell, bro. It just it just a disaster over there. Yeah, no, it's a shit show. They do things that, and the people be like, yo, yo, it's like the most programming is happening there, bro. Because you see, baby, you're acting, you're thinking, yo, yo, this are, is I, the same world that we live <laughs> in. Are you really thinking like that? <laughs> nah, 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 nah for real. 
some things when I see them on social media and everything, yeah, and I hear some people talk, I'm really thinking, wait, are we actually in the same world? Yeah. Like, you're really thinking like this. No, it's scary. But you can tell a lot of people don't know that they have been programmed. Mm. You yeah, know I mean, what I'm saying? People yeah. legit have been programmed. This is how you think. This is what you say. This is how you behave. If you go outside the system, you will get demonized. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just what it is. And actually, governments are falling for it. Yeah, bro. Like the bare governments are being toppled just on this. Do you know why ideology? You know? Do you know so, why? Because the, because it's the people with the liberal liberals. I, 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 I forgot what they're called, but the liberals. Yeah, they are the ones that are running some of these governments now. Yeah, you I, mean, go, I mean, they're the ones that run some of these governments. So these ideologies are being now fed into like the propaganda and everything you know what i'm saying yeah. and sometimes when i just got happening like thinking yo i can't believe like people are actually really really thinking like this and think this is normal you know uh, what i'm saying normal. but sticking to this bit again i think if you were giving okay boom who would you swap it would you would you swap it for a basketballer or another spy like if you're giving opportunity it was in your hands to swap okay We've got this. Hold on, thing. am I America? Oh, yeah, you're America, Russia. of course. Yeah, you're yeah, America. Yeah, yeah. It can't be Russia, but yeah. you don't do Russia. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, bro, they look like they are beating Americans' ass right now, bro. Yeah, yeah, I mean, <laughs> this wrestling match right now looks like, yo, it's one sided so I far. Think it's just the priorities, in my opinion. I mm. feel like if you put someone so high up the, that chain, then it goes for another high for value as well. So, no, yeah, I think also what it is is in the West, we prioritize entertainers yeah to an extent yeah. entertainers superstars celebrities mm. and all those mm. kind of yeah, things yeah, yeah. they are over here then mm. the people that are actually doing the work doing well, for yeah, the yeah. government nobody gives well, a shit about yeah, them because if you look at soldiers if you look at veterans and everything no one cares about them you nobody get what i'm saying yeah. but but because you can sing because you can run because you can play basketball you're held all like your word goes you know what I'm saying? And Your to me, is high. yeah, and to me, that's for a reason why if you look at countries that know what their priorities are, they are kicking everybody's ass. If you look at countries like China, if you look at countries like, you know, some of these countries that are strict, they are not into all that bullshit. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Straight, straight to business. Straight, straight to business. But, but then but then at the same time, I'm not saying that. You know, it's it's a wrong move. No, 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 no. no. I well, we're happy for the for her family. Yeah, you know, bro. Uh, wife, everybody, you know, related to her. But at the end of the day, if, if I was American government, I would be swapping her for another of our spy. Yeah, but it's in the hands of Russia, though. No, but no, it's hand of Russia because we want them. Say, our America now, we want this. This is who we want. So Russia said, okay, if you want this person, give us this person. Yeah, but but. But then, but then, if you say, all right, cool, this is the person that we want, and Russia say, nah. Then we keep this other person again, because they really wanted that, that my man. Yep, yeah, but the then, big... yeah, but then this girl would, would not have to be in jail now. Yeah, but if, if, you're, if you're getting the other guy out, she's going to still be in jail, isn't it? Yeah, bro. It's a, it's a bit of a tough one. That, it's, it's, it's a tricky, it's tough. You got I me? Mean? That is the reason why it's not like an either... Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so no. They, there's no wrong or right or whatever it's, they've done what they've done we're happy yeah. for we're happy for Britney Rugena she can come back do her basketball <laughs> do her basketball thing, bro. and stop stop packing him weed bait <laughs> fam exactly stop packing, fam. check your flipping luggage before you travel bro. listen if you're going to if you're going to people's country check what their rules and regulations yeah, are man for check. real you, you get check. me but also I've got this conspiracy theory in my head mm. right don't agree with me yeah bro I'm looking at it from this perspective, and maybe because I my my whole thing has been on a moral based thing, right? One, I might actually argue: Did she really had that vape on her, or did they plant it? Because well, she, she's not denying it, though. She didn't deny it. She cannot deny it if she's over there. If, if you deny I'm over there, wait, you, you know what's gonna happen? <laughs> yeah, I, I feel it. You know what I'm saying? So we go yeah. tell. Listen, babe. This, this is what, the rule. This is what we need you to talk. Mm. This is what we need you to say. Mm. And we know they smile with you. Yeah. Yeah. So then you you go look camera. Yo, Brittany, did you have? Yeah, I had it with me. I'm sorry. You get what I'm saying, yeah. bro? I'm telling you. Yeah. That is my other conspiracy theory. Now she might have had it or whatever. But then also, yeah, this is where I'm actually thinking. Because she is not a threat to the country over there. 
I'm talking about Russia. She's not trash. She's not a spy and all this kind. She's a, she she's just a basketballer, someone that just came and play basketball, right? Mm. And I believe that she is a a pawn on the chessboard of this whole Russia, Ukraine versus America, NATO, and all that kind of bullshit, right? I believe that she was just a pawn. They just held her, yeah, knowing that America might play the desperate game, right? And then they can get this man out. It, it's all a game, right? And you saw in the news where they said that, oh, she was in the prison and she's suffering and everything. Bro, I think if, if it was me, because I'm also putting my moral thing out, yeah, yes, I want this guy out. Bro, I don't think she was put in the prison. I think they probably just kept her in a nice house like this. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, us in the West, we don't know what's happening over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they just kept her in a nice house right here, fed her, you know, she could watch TV and everything, but she cannot do anything. She can't say she can't leave. You know what I mean? So she's just there, just chilling and everything. And then you guys over there are saying, yo, she's about to die. Be, yeah. This, this, da, 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 da. Bro, I honestly think that. No, no, but to, to that though, pictures have come out of where she was. Like, but the, we don't know if if the pictures are real though. How did but, they get the pictures? But we saw her with an inmate eating, and then where she used to sleep a little bed. All those things can be photo pops, uh, yeah, um, yeah. photo ops, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, but yeah, I mean, the, the thing is, she was she wasn't in some you know concentration camp or whatever. It was. I don't like, think I don't think she was in some concentration um, concentration camp struggling and everything, yeah, yeah. bro. I think. They must have kept her in a nice apartment somewhere, tucked away. Yeah. <laughs> That's a tucked away. Yeah. yeah. No communication with the outside world. With blank duvets and all yeah, that. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> because, because you know why? Do you know yeah. the reason why I get this one? When I was little, yeah, no water for lie. I'm not going to mention the man's name, but the man was my dad's friend. This was back in Nigeria. Yeah. This was when I believe it, it was either Abacha or Obasanjo. Yeah put the man in prison, right? So the man was meant to be in prison. The man's my dad's friend. He's a politician. He got him a big guy in the army at that time, yeah? So in the news, it says that the man is in prison, mm. yeah? But you know UNTH in, UNTH in Enugu, they got out a nice... Um, quarters. Quarters. Yeah, turned that into a living room, bedroom, and stuff like that. And that was where the man was. Chilling. Chilling. Obviously, he can't leave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. in the evenings like this, me and my dad, we could go give, uh, we go, you know, get food and stuff like that. You know, send food, give the man everything. Like, he's eating proper. But when my dad and my mom go to go visit the man because he's their friend, yeah, they will also take food and everything mm. and all that. Yeah. But no, in no, the it news, does happen. Yeah, but yeah, in yeah. the news, they go tell you say the man they cri cri. Yeah, yeah they f- dead row. You get what I'm saying? So to me, to me, maybe this this thing might come out one day. But I don't think she was in one small cell suffering and doing nah nah nah. nah no, nah, but that's nah. why that's why she's gonna she's gonna. I mean, uh, trust me. By next week, she'll be on every talk show. Boom, Spill, yeah. spilling her own tea. But she needs yeah, to but make she, a bit of money as well. Yes, no, she she might tell stories, yeah. But once again, I'm not saying this is fact. This is just my conspiracy theory, whatever. Yeah, but I don't think she can. She will be able to say that because it doesn't do America any good, yeah, 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 they yeah, will yeah. want to paint the worst picture about Russia. True, you get what I'm true, saying? True, true, true. That's if point. that's the case. Mm-hmm. You get me? Yeah. They want to paint the worst picture about Russia and everything to, to the world. But that's just me saying. So, so what you're saying, we, we expect her to come and be like, yo, I was in some yeah, death, death row. Yeah, working, they wanted to kill me over there. 18 yeah, yeah. hours yeah, a day. Bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro. Because it's a propaganda war, isn't it? Yeah, no, it is. It's a propaganda war. On both sides. On, on both sides. On both sides. Big this, this is propaganda not... war. That is the reason why, honestly, I don't believe nothing the media says. No, me, me too. You got me? I've gotten to that point, yeah, with everything that has happened in recent times, yeah. If the media tells me, cancel this person, yeah, I will have to go and do my research first because yeah. nine times out of ten, the guy is probably saying or doing something, yeah, that media does not want the normal people to know. Mm. They want to control the narrative. They always are. That's that's why they're there. People people forget the media is people's personal businesses. Yeah, bro. 
Then people own this shit and be like, you know what, well, the same way you want your business to thrive and then you want, okay, do this this way. That's the same way people are controlling this media. Fam, you know? fam. I've seen documentaries on Modoc. I don't know if you know this guy, this Mod- Modoc yeah, guy. Yeah, that's News yeah, of the World guy. Yeah, 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 he owned Fox. He owned, I, I believe, ITV or something like that, I believe. No, not ITV. He knows News of the World and then newspapers, isn't it? Yeah, like newspapers. And then, but like, he, he, he was big in America. Son and then Yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah. When you're talking about controlling news, narratives, and everything, he had it at the back of his hands, bro. They were doing loads. He had it at the back. Of, I'm telling you, yeah, I've been reading recently, yeah, bros, people like Coach, the Coach family, you get what I'm saying? Like, different, I've been reading different things and realizing, bro, this world that we live in, we are just a dot in this world, bro. There are people, you people like you and I, yeah, we are talking about, yo, we can't wait to get paid at the end of the month and everything. There are people that money is no longer their issue. Or their issue now is they just sit in the in, in their living room and just make a call, yeah, and put presidents on the seat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are people that are making those decisions, Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah. Sure. Now, but, for but, real. But, but the real thing is the power lies with us, though. The power don't, does not lie with us. No, it truly lies with it us. It does not. But the thing is, we do not realize it, it does bro. Not. not that it does. If, it we, that, listen, if you realize it, mm. you see that the power lies with us. Fam. See that that power they've got is is the ones the, where they can buy. If we refuse to entertain that bullshit, yeah, but it's yeah, not but, gonna run though. Yeah, but we can't though. You get me? Because we are already programmed though. You get me? The masses are already programmed. As long as you can control the ears, the eyes, and the mind of the masses, you can control them. Yeah, you got me. Mom, that is it. That, that's so, why the media is so important to them. Yeah, I know, bro. I'm, I'm telling you, fam. I was seeing some things. Yeah, even some things that they did to to um Dave Chappelle and all that stuff back in the day. You know, fam. I can't find the video no more. But I was watching this morning and everything. Yeah, people legit believe that the guy was a crackhead, but that was because of some deal that he wouldn't take. The propaganda was out there. The narrative was, was that he was a cracker for 20 years. He did not get a job. Yeah. That is the world that we live in. There are people, if they decide to make you look crazy, yeah, they yeah. will make you look crazy. Yeah. And if they decide to turn it around, they will turn it around. That's a fact. Yeah, it's just because the majority of us are sheep, bro. That's but that's just what it is, bro. But, but, but I'm not sh- Yeah, brother. But anyways, shout out to all of them, though. Yeah, you yeah, get yeah. me? Fam. Have you seen um this Grant Wall guy, the reporter? Yeah, yeah, I, I, I heard that shit, you know. I heard it on the news, like, the, that died, didn't it? Yeah, he yeah. died yesterday, innit? God damn, that's crazy. But I heard it on the news, I'm like, yo, what's this? Because they're wasting a fuss about, you know, obviously trying to bring about the Qatar and then, the, you know, safety. And I'm like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, um, just before the World Cup started, you know the whole LGBT, yeah. LGBTQ, Thing that was happening in plus, Qatar. Plus, plus it? yeah, yeah, that was happening in Qatar. Thank you very much, man. You get me? That was happening in everything. So yeah. I, I believe he wore a t-shirt. You got me? The rainbow t-shirt, son. Yeah. So they didn't allow him to come into the stadium. Yeah. So That's it became at a, the then, isn't it? Then, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah. it became a big thing and everything. And then all of a sudden, news came out yesterday that that he died. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm like thinking, God damn. I don't know, but I don't want to feed into that conspiracy, whatever. But hey, bro, a lot of things are happening, yeah, bro. Yeah. Like, no, have you, fam, have you heard um the four crypto billionaires as well? Yeah, 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 I saw that. That just all of a sudden allegedly died. That that that's scary, bro. That is scary, bro. Uh, if be, that's true, <laughs> yo, that is mad, bro. If that's true, yeah, that is like the Jason Bond movie, fam. Yeah. But but think, come think of it though, it's not their fault that the shit crashed though. Like crypto is all on the embassy. We know it crashed. We all that you know people lost lost a lot of money. But it's not. Is it their fault? Are we saying it, they had something to do with it? I don't think. I don't know. I don't, bro. I've never really been to the whole crypto thing. I don't know how to trade and everything. I don't. I I've got a couple of friends of mine that are into it. You get what I'm saying? But I don't know how the thing works. I'm I'm not gonna sit here and lie. I don't know how the crypto thing works, bro. Bro, people, lo- people lost a lot. A lot of money, people bro. lost a lot of money. On Fuck that. it, they're yeah, like yeah. people had this, and then the next day, and I keep saying, you know, people. I mean, we know when it was green and dandy, people, mm. you know, people were making a lot of money. Yeah, absolutely. But then again, it's it's not real money until you've taken it out, though. I always say that it's not yours until you have it. Boom, take taking it out of there and they put it to 
of your own choice. Like, this is what I want to put in. So, yeah, it yeah, can, yeah. It, 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 you know, let's take out three zeros of this shit. It affects everyone. But I'm not going to lie. I took out some money, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know. I really took out some money. I think it was maybe like about two years ago. There was a time that Bitcoin just went up. You get what I'm saying? And and someone advised me to put some money in a couple years ago. I think it was maybe like about 2014-ish, 2015. So I put in some money there and I forgot about the money. And it went up. I cashed out. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. You get me, bro. Until you, until you cash out, it's not really yeah, cash. Yeah, but, but you know what? Do you, you, you know what these guys did? Immediately I cashed out. Went up again. No, immediately I cashed out. They, they saw spending my account. For real? Oh, I swear to God. Oh, you know what what are they trying to say? No, bro? no, it's 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 not my bank account. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah no, it's your not crypto, my bank account. Crypto yeah, wallet or whatever yes, it was. Yes, yeah, yeah. my crypto account and everything. They suspended it. I swear to God. Because I cashed out, bro, I cashed out big money. So they're probably wondering shit. And they they suspended it for a couple of days. So, so it's in their business to let people leave it in there and then yo, obviously it's for them. Remember the, the they also there to make money as well, yeah. and a lot of people were cashing out as well. Yeah, a lot of people cashed out. You get me? A, a lot, lot of people, people cashed out. But so the, the faithfuls left it there to be like, you know what? Yeah, it's gonna. Even when the whole turmoil, like before even we got to when it crashed, mm. it was you know it was going up and down. It was you know yeah yeah yeah, yeah. not settled. It was up and down, up, up and down. down. Yeah, yeah. People were still having faith, like but until it. Bro, crashed. I cashed out quick, bro. Yeah. No, but I, I didn't wanna. Out. You get me? Like I didn't wanna risk it. No, but the heads of my people are taking out. I, we're, we're not saying taking out because I don't know. We don't know, fam. <laughs> suddenly dropping like flies. They bro. are dropping like flies, bro. And that is suspicious to fam, me. Absolutely, bro. I don't, I don't know about you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> fam, I'm telling you, yeah. But they say that art imitates life. Mm. If we think that all those things that's happening in the Jason Bond films and all that, it's, it's not happening in real life. Yeah. Bro, I seriously believe, yeah that when we are on the road walking around yeah that there are spies and and people around us bro i seriously believe that as in what in what sense L- like like maybe on the train on the bus and everything bro. Yeah, 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 yeah i seriously believe that no no but yeah but it's there's evidence to it like you see i mean come on this russian guy the the american guy they call him russia they call him with classified documents didn't it bro if so, you even forget, if you forget, do you remember the Russian spy who was in in the UK um, who got killed a couple of years ago? You remember? Some oh two, yeah, in you know in a truck in you know, a box where some something like that. But two Russian spies came from Russia down to the UK by my man. Oh yeah, that's the, the, the yeah, 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 yeah. The, the thing with what's it was Salisbury or something. Yeah, something like what's going on, my guy? Or oh, looking fresh in that breath. My guy. Yo, 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 yo. This guy been hitting the gym, you know. I was going to say that, you know. This guy been hitting the gym heavy, bro. <laughs> man, 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 man looking cut through, you know, uh, but. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hit the gym and that, bro. Nah, bro. For, but for real. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I seriously believe, yeah, because, because, and this is probably not a good thing, like, like the fitness. I was telling him, bro, I've been reading a lot of shit, right? I've been reading a lot of books, a, a lot of articles and everything, yeah. And I seriously believe, I seriously believe, yeah, that, that there are spies, yeah, 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 government spies around us. Of course. You get me? At my old place, yeah, I was telling um, Khadija then, we had a neighbor, yeah. No, this house was on the market, yeah. Mm. And all of a sudden, the house was bought by this Chinese family. A man, his wife, his son, and his daughter. They bought the house, did up the house, boom, 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 boom. Yeah? They must have spent a lot of money on that house. But guess what? Nobody was staying in that house. Mm. Nobody was staying in that house. They will be away for maybe about two months. Then they come back. Then you see them. But then guess what they did? They have cameras in front of the house. Yeah? And this man bought... Not stereotyping, but but this man bought a car. He didn't even know how to drive. So he bought a car and started to learn how to drive with the new car that he bought. But what shocked me one day was, at that time, like I was w- doing nights. So I was coming back home around 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. And I saw this guy. 
he was stood opposite the road by three o'clock in the morning in all black and a bag. And he was standing there looking straight to his house. Like he was standing there for like about five to ten minutes just looking around straight to his house and everything. By three o'clock in the morning, bro. I'd back my mind, I said, this guy, I, this guy's a spy, bro. <laughs> no, but there, there are spies. There are spies around yeah, us, yeah, no, bro. Of course. Like in every country, like this superpowers, say Russia, America, you know, France, whatever. They've got, it's their business to have people in your country to, you know. Yeah, it's mad though, keep, 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 keep tabs on what's going on. Yeah, of course. Would, would you like to be a spy? Well, but anything we do. No, 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 bro. If the money is person. right, though. If, if the money is right. Like... The money is right. You can travel anywhere in the world. You can do whatever you want to do. Would well, do you want to be a spy? Ah, uh, nah, bro. I don't need that stress, bro. Yo, fam, how about you? Spy? Uh, no, no, no. I like the job work. I love working for the spy. Is it? <laughs> fam. I can't really work because they don't really get time off, do they? They're just on the job. On the job, yeah, 24 cents, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're literally living a life for 24 hours of your the, every day of your life, be like, like you hear people. I mean, even there's stories back in the day where you hear people they've got family somewhere, but they know them as something, and they, they realize yo, mama's got family somewhere. You know, yeah, yeah it was on the news one time, yeah. some time ago, wasn't it? Yeah, it's mad. Those are spies. Nah, it's mad, bro. Let me tell you something. Yeah, I was watching. There's this podcast I'm I'm actually into, Lex Friedman. So he interviews different people. Yeah. Scientists and all. So yeah. there was this guy. Um, I've forgotten his name, but his last name is Buntamanti or something like that. Yeah, he's a spy. Well, he he used to be a he's a former spy, a former CIA. Yeah, bro, my man was telling his story, and he broke down how the human psychology works. How when you meet someone, if you want to get someone to trust you, you go. I mean, all this, bro, he broke this thing down, and then he broke down how. He became a spy. Fam, that shit is interesting, boy. You get me? And he said that they will go, they will find someone. You don't know that they're watching you. Yeah. But they will find someone, yeah, who does not look like anything. Like, he looks maybe hungry, homeless, or whatever. Yeah. Because how they found him was, all of a sudden, he was in front of the computer applying for jobs. And a pop-up came up on his computer. And they say, oh, stop what you're doing. Fill out this form, boom, 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 if you're interested and all this kind of stuff. So he said that he, he didn't have nothing going on in his life. So he said, okay, cool. Send. All of a sudden, he got a mail in his mailbox. Fill out this, do this. So they are basically giving you instructions. They, they, they sent him a flight ticket. They said, come over to, to this city in America go over to this house and, and he was just doing all that mm -hmm. doing all that bro it took like a period of like six months you get me bro he became a CIA spy and he would literally go into places he would disguise himself and all that bro he broke all this shit down he was a spy his wife was a spy so he married in the business. He married in the yeah, business. Yeah, because you have to... Because normally, a normal person, you can't stick with a normal person yeah. for long. Yeah. You got me. He married in the business and everything, which part of the reason why they left was they not ended up having a baby. That, that's bad for business. You got me. So they couldn't really do it, bro. Yeah, man. No, no, but they are spies. Come on. It's a job. Like the MI's flipping five or six or whatever. They've got an office in, in, in the city, bro. It's there. You see people going in, going in and coming out of there. So what? What are you? Are you a janitor there? Or what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. Are you? You gotta be like, are, are, you, are you a cleaner there or something? <laughs> you, 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 I mean, you're, you're, you're me. staff. If you're staff there, you're a spy. Obviously, some of them don't go international, wherever. But when it's time to go, be like, boom, pack your bags, you're going. Bro, listen, fam. He broke because they asked him. Yeah, the I believe the four or the five most dangerous um um like intel whatever in the world bro he said the chinese he said the cia he said mossad mm. then I, I think he said the french but he said that the biggest is the chinese because of their ideology right wherever a chinese is in the world first and foremost they are chinese yeah. before anything else so they are loyal to their kingdom so mm. with, with that ideology, yeah, 
it's easy for most of them to be spies, just walking around there. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, man. And it's hard for you to detect because you obviously cannot, you, you, cannot. you know they're they're very very they're nationalist, isn't it? Yeah. So you cannot. You can fly off, but yeah. You get me. But so yeah. now, so you're gonna you want to be a spy, yeah? You don't you don't you would entertain the opportunity. The kind of person that I am, <laughs> yeah. If I say yes, they might not call me. Mm. So I will say no for them to call me. <laughs> I would like to be a spy though. <laughs> I like shit like that. I like shit like that. Because, because honestly, I wanted to be a soldier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanted to join the army. Mm. The only reason why I didn't was because of my mom. Mm. My mom said, no, 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 no. Like things like that. I just, I'm, it got, I'm very inquisitive. I'm very adventurous. I just want to know what happens outside of our realm. Uh. But that just me though. Testing, testing them boundaries. Testing yeah. them boundaries. See what's out there, yeah, man. Yeah, you get me, but you know what? At the end of the day, rest in peace to Grant Wall. Yeah. You get me. Obviously, he very sad. Died in Qatar and everything, man. You get me. It's so sad and everything, man. But about the FIFA thing, bro. Brazil and Argentina, man. Yeah. Yesterday was a crazy. No, even thing. before we go into that, but are you not? Are you enjoying the World Cup or not? Yes, I'm, so I'm loving it, Brav. I think this is the best World Cup so far. I was. This is exactly what I was telling somebody the other day. I'm like, yo. Listen, I, I know I've not, I've not, I've not seen like a hundred World Cups, but listen, this is, this in my is lifetime, yeah, this yeah, is yeah. the best so far. You yeah, don't even know who's gonna win it. You don't. Not, not even just that. The spectators, like the fans, the every, every state, yo, people are out there. You don't know who's gonna win but it. But before the World Cup, but say prior to this World Cup, but we thought it was gonna be a failure, bro. I know. I thought, I thought it was going to be like... Because shit. of the media, though, wasn't yeah, it? I thought, like, yo, Because of the propaganda this? wars and all that stuff. Going on about... A, a, a lot of, uh, at one point, people were raising hell about beer, drinking beers, and doing damn, like... Drink, what, drink the alcohol in your house and then go, go, go to there, the stadium, what's, what's that about? You get me? You well, know? It's, been, it's been good to see that, you know, the atmosphere has been... No, very, no, very no. Nice. It's been a great, a great tournament so far, man. Very great Bro, tournament. imagine, imagine... Cristiano Ronaldo and Messi in the finals, bruv. Yeah. That would be a great but, way. But bro, that would be a great way to end the career. That would be a great way, but I don't want I don't want Argentina to get there, B. I don't know. Personally, I don't Why? Um, shit, that shit they done the other day with 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 um flipping. What did they who did they play with again? Um, um are you talking about the Netherlands? Yeah. The arrogance against that. I don't like that. Fam, if you don't want me to be arrogant, beat me. Yeah, well, yeah. They, they almost did though. Yeah, but they did it. <laughs> no, that, I don't like. But it's that, a competition, bro. No, if I know you know what we, I know, I know, but they were moving mad. Yeah, bro. Listen, they were moving it's, mad. it's it's a war within them for them four lines, bro. You get me? If if you don't want me to be arrogant, beat me. No. That's sports for you, bro. But personally, yeah. No, 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 no. Who do you think is gonna get? Croatia, Croatia is gonna do them. You think so? I, I want no, them, you honestly, want you I want, want them, yeah. Croatia to I want, do them. I want Croatia to do them, but I don't care. But Messi, I love Messi. Don't get me wrong, yeah. but the whole the whole Argentina team, the whole arrogance with the whole thing, like nah, yeah, for What's real, that? nah. But we just seen Brazil go out. So what do you mean? Anybody can go out, bro. If Messi wins this, yeah, he's yeah, gonna go down. Says, yeah, yeah, that says a lot. Now this is his World Cup. You get me? This, unfortunately, yeah, this is meant to be. Him and Cristiano Ronaldo's World Cup. But for some weird reason, bro, the media have succeeded in demonizing Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah. For some weird yeah. reason, bro. Anything this guy does is a big deal now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always been, but now it's like negative. They are looking yeah, for him yeah, yeah. now. Yeah. They are looking for him. And I think it was because of the whole thing that happened. It's the old with, Manchester United. The United, United thing. thing. Yeah, the old United thing. You get me? Like, he, he attacked the biggest club in the UK. Yeah. So obviously the media is going to come for you. That's just what it is. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? But personally, I want to see Brazil. I want to see, I say Brazil. I want to see Messi, Cristiano Ronaldo in the World Cup. You get what I'm saying? Personally. No, I want to see, I want to see me? England in the final, bro. What are you chatting about? I mean, bro, we we, we should be praying for England to be um, France, France tonight. No, that's going to be crazy. You get me? They, they got to pray, bro. They have to pray and play. No, nah, but they're going them, though. My boy is Saka, bro. You think so, And though? Sterling is back as well. Yeah, bro. But fam. They... Sterling is back, kid. After, yeah, the, after the whole whatever, he's back, uh, back and firing. But fam, they've, they've got Mbappe there, fam. <laughs> but bro, but just Mbappe. imagine if they had Mbappe and um, Flipping, um, what's this guy's name again? 
the um, the striker who got injured. The Real Madrid guy. Oh, Benzema. I- imagine if they had Mbappé. No, Benzema. if Benzema was on, that is... It, <laughs> no, but we say that, though. We were saying that for Brazil before the World Cup started. Though. Yeah, but Brazil, though... Brazil have individual... To yeah. me, to me, that's my issue with Brazil and Argentina. They have individual great players, but I don't think they are a team. You get what I'm saying? They have to always depend on either Neymar to do something or, or Messi to do something. You get what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah. Like, but when you come to the France team, yeah, yes, Benzema is great. Yeah. And uh, Mbappe is great. But they are more of a team. True, than this true. other two. True, true. So it's going to be very hard to beat them. Anyone can, can beat you. Anyone can score you. Mm. You get me? But unless Messi does something, you get yeah, me? There's no yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, and because of their greatness, players will always defer to them. You know, if you look at Portugal, bro, they demolished these other guys. Cristiano Ronaldo was not there. So everyone was now free to play. Mm-mm-mm. But if Cristiano Ronaldo is there because of who he you is, you want to play to his start. You want to his play tone, to his yeah. Uh, yeah. You get me because you're expecting him to do some magic and everything. You know. No, oh, true. You got a point there. But I'm loving this this World nah, Cup. Nah, I am loving it. I'm loving the World Cup. To bro. top it off, if England wins it, to top it off, man. Or oh, you know what? Boy, what am I chatting about? Morocco should win it, bro. Morocco should win it. They don't have a chance. No, they do. But I get, but coming out of that group, we did not see them coming out of that group. Nah, nobody saw them coming out of that, that group, but it's going to be a tough one still. It's going to be a tough one, bro. If they beat, obviously, you are, I, mean, I know you're rooting for CR7, but they should beat Portugal, bro. You think if, so? If they beat Portugal, then... then oh, oh, bro, if they beat Portugal, if they beat Portugal that is going to be an upset, fam. No, Big yeah, upset. Yeah. But this is the World Cup of upsets, though. That's it, bro. I, I'm loving it, though. Yeah, Shout out to everyone involved still. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. You get yeah. me? Bro, should we dive into before we get out of here, man? You get me? Because we are linking up the boys tonight, bro. Yeah. You get me? Should we dive into Mega Marco or should we di- dive into the band? Mega Marco. Before Mar- we even go that, bro. Yo, I, I saw, is this, I was going to ask, I was going to save you to ask you, bro. I, I hear my mom, Robert Kelly, has got an album. Bro, bro listen, bro. That's an album or a sing. What's this? <laughs> bro, it's an album, bro. Listen, fam. That guy should be thinking about how to get out of the jail first. You yeah, get me? But, 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 but then, you know what the funny thing is? And once again, we don't know what to believe. So the album came out. Mm. And in one of the songs, he was talking about, obviously, that he's into um, older chicks and young chicks. You lot over there, call it a pedophile. That's your opinion. That's one of the lyrics. That actually was wild, right? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that was one of the songs. That was one of the songs. Go, 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 go to check it out, man. I think the name of the song is I Admitted or something like that, where he said that he's, he's into older chicks He's into young girls, but you guys are saying that is pedophile. That's your opinion, right? But then he released a statement from Joe mm. saying that he has nothing to do with the album. Yeah? Yes. So he, rele- he released a statement saying that he has nothing to do with the album. Sonny released their own statement saying that they have nothing to do with the album. Where did he come out from then? What label put it out? Like, it, it should say there, like, credit should go to what? Produce? Bro, do the maths, bro. <laughs> <laughs> bro, do the maths. Everyone's covering their heads. Bro. bro, do the maths. You get what I'm saying? Like, but then this is the thing, yeah. Mm-hmm. People sh- talk about cancel culture and everything, yeah. Counseling R. Kelly and everything, yeah. Bro, these record companies, they still want to make money off my man. Not my yeah. man, but they still want to make money off him. Off his art, yeah. They still want to make money off him. <gasps> so which one is it then? Are you really trying to cancel him or not? Well, you know what I'm saying? You could cancel, but when the, when the green is involved, but you follow the money, innit? it? That's just what it is. But that's what, the money. Yeah, but that's what it is with all these record companies. You get me? So he's saying he has nothing to do with the album, that he didn't authorize it, he didn't release it. The record company, Sonic, is saying that, hey that it wasn't authorized and everything. Now, because of that, um, like Apple Music have taken it down. Spotify has taken it down as well. Oh, they've taken it down then. No yeah, ground. they've taken it down and everything. But, but then everyone is thinking, yo, G, you're in prison and if, if you're trying to release an album right now, bro, what's going on with you? 
Oh, it should be the album should be written is to be it should be forgive me please forgive me please. <laughs> <laughs> no, no 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 bro at this point no unfortunately nobody want to hear any explanation yeah, for no, because I, I saw i didn't even come like what, what is this man? yeah bro i saw it on the shade room you, you know it just one them ones i didn't even even want to bother to go ladies, listen to the thing like you know it just one them ones uh, it's a very tough one. It's a very tough one because we always say separate the art from the individual. Yeah, we do. You know, but but some of the things, when you hear some of the things that this guy did, obviously none of us were there, so we don't know if it's true or not. But from what we've seen, bro, it's wild. It's you wild. get what I'm saying? And and I can't really be bagging your tune knowing that you probably, you probably allegedly wrote this from the inspiration of whatever you were doing, bro. It is a tough one. If you're saying banging his old tunes, bro, there's some of his old tunes that some of his uh, bro, his old tunes slaps. Some of, some, some of God damn, tunes, some of some of the old tunes is like. Fam, we are talking about R. Kelly right here, bro. Some of his old tunes, but you see, if people start something new, nah, yeah, I'm, not, I'm not gonna be. I, I yeah, you're not gonna even, go listen to nah, it. Nah, I'm not even going. I'm not even checking it. Yeah, like how about Kanye, um, Kanye West though? If if he puts out some new song, are you, are you gonna go check it? Kanye West now is the, I mean, as far as I'm concerned, is he is I mean, he's come out to apologize for every wrong, but obviously not the latest one. But because it's Kanye, but but before we even go in there, I'm not too into that rap though. Oh yeah, you 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 know. So really if it's rap, something yeah. like out of the out of the blue, where it's like beyond rap, it's like yeah. some major major Cut. tune. Yeah, then yeah. Cut. If R if R Kelly or and and Kanye West drop a new album, are, are you gonna go check it? <laughs> oh, yeah. you're gonna go to a, a Kanye West show? <laughs> no, 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 oh, bro. No, for Kanye, yeah. Kanye, fam, if he, I mean, if Kanye West is coming, I'm going to the show, bro. Allow that, man. Yeah. If Kanye West is coming, I, I doubt if that's gonna happen anytime soon. Mm-mm. You know what I'm saying? Because my man has, when you're talking about digging yourself into a hole, yeah, he's dug himself into this hole, bro. You get me? Yeah. It's gonna take God to come out of that. You know what I'm saying? No, it's it's crazy. But if, if if his album drops tomorrow, I'm listening to it, bro. Yeah, to a few. I'm not gonna be a fan of like nah, banging it. No. I'm not doing all, all that. All that. Um, don't listen to Ray. Cancel his credit. Nah. You get me? I don't agree with what some some of the things that he said, but I'm still going to the concert still. Yeah, so you you so it's it's a pick and choose thing. Then yes, there's there's something that's be like, you know, bro, we is... are all hypocrites, bro. Yeah, let no, us not, bro. No, let no, yeah, us not. Of course we are, bro. Let us not even have that no, whole conversation. But I'm not because... being no no underage girl though. No, 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 no. On that, no, there's no, no hypocrisy that, there. To but, me, to yeah. me, to me, and that's my thing with Balenciaga as well. Whatever you're doing, yeah, leave kids, yeah, keep kids out of it. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Leave kids. Leave mothers mm-hmm. out of it. Do whatever you want to do. You know what I'm saying? But nah, no kids. Man. When you came to kids, like nah, 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 nah. nah, nah you nah, can't, you nah, can't. Nah. Be you doing that. We, we, we can't stand for that. No, nah, we cannot. Stand for <laughs> we that, can't. Bro. No, you're tripping now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you're tripping now. You know, yeah, yo, yeah, bro. Yeah. Have you seen the whole like Meghan Markle thing? Nah, I saw that. You know. What yeah. do you think about that? Three docu- um, three episodes. Yeah. yeah. Of the new documentary, obviously them detailing their whole ordeal with um how they met, Mm-mm. you know, their their whole thing with the paparazzi and all that yeah. stuff, man. But I think before even I go to what I think of it, but I watched the whole thing, you know, from season episode one to three, boom. Same year. I, I did. That there was no going to ah, this is boring. Nah, I enjoyed it, bro. I, I enjoyed it. I was story. happy, I was happy to hear from them. Yeah. Like yeah. they had their own side of it. Yeah, I, listen, I enjoyed it, even though I know that my man, P.S. Morgan, bro, he's been on that girl's neck, bro. Bob, he called, he already called them uh, Kim, <laughs> lower Kim Kardashian. Bro, like, he's been Kardashian on that, bro. With, with no IQ, bro, whatever, what did he say? If you uh, go on that man's Twitter, yeah, yeah no, he's, he's been, been on that girl's neck, bro. But it just one of them ones. I enjoyed the documentary, totally loved it. I'm happy for Harry, especially. Yeah. Because when he was telling his story, yeah, about obviously him growing up, seeing what happened to his mom and everything, yeah, you can tell he never really got got over that. No. What his mom went through, right? He never really got over that, and he prob he probably didn't 
did not heal from that and he probably had the resentment now obviously we don't know what 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 must have happened behind closed doors but with the things that he was saying at some point he even had to go to africa yeah when you had to go was it botswana somewhere botswana, in the south. botswana yeah. and everything so he was going there like every three months you know spending time there and you could tell listening to him speak right you could tell he's not made for that environment no, yeah, that not. that buckingham palace environment he's not made for that the whole system is, nah, he's is, not made is for, not it. for it no, you no. get me like he wants to live a normal life yeah he wants to live a normal life because i was listening to one of the guys in the documentary speak here yeah, and he was saying listen that he does not envy the royal family bro you are not even in charge of your future you cannot make decisions on your own. You're told what to do, how to smile, how to behave, and all this kind of like you're basically a robot. Your handlers are the ones that are controlling you. You know what I'm saying? But on, even on on that, be rid of a robot. But one eye opening thing was, you know, when Megan said like the whole cut, the whole you know, it, that's not even outside. Like even behind, even in your room, they're meant to behave like that as well. Yeah, that was mad. Yeah. Bro, listen, I'm like, what? Yeah, bro, that is the thing, though. If you, if you, unless you are born into that, even people that are born into that sometimes struggle. They struggle. Yeah, unless you're born into that, yeah, bro, mm. you are going to struggle. You are going to struggle. That yep. is like, bro, it's not a coincidence, yeah. That's the same thing, like, if you come into the Kardashian world where everything is camera, you're told what to say, what to do, what to post, and all this kind of shit. Bro, at some point, you're you going to be like, like, what the hell? Because that's not what you're used to. You're used to. Yeah. You living know, your life living your life making your own decisions and everything but you can't make your decisions no more you can't even smile you can't you can't do shit you got me in so listening to harry speak yeah bro i knew for for the longest he's been trying to get out of there you get me but the only thing is he needed somebody who was going to put the battery in his back yeah you somebody you can fall fall on like yeah. someone you can follow and be like yo that your backbone kind exactly of thing. Yeah. some support yes he needed that you get me? And when Megan came along, she did that for him. Mm. You get what I'm saying? She did that for him. So I was happy for him, especially for Megan. Now, this is going to be interesting because I've got, because I've seen things playing out about, you know, the whole blackness. No, no. But I think, Bro, f- okay, go on. I just think people going on to her be like, yo, feeling like, some the you do we realize that some people out there, black people that have not experienced racism though. Yeah. There are loads of them. There are loads so, of them. So 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 why is Megan's one an issue then? Because she's what I don't think she's married to Harry. He, yeah, but this is the thing. I don't think it's hard to say. I, I think it's people are looking at the mom. Like you're a black woman with dreads. You get what I'm saying? You are a black woman and you're not just a black woman, you're with dreads. Yeah. Well, if there is one thing that you should do. Mm-hmm is to teach your child, make your child understand that at some point in life, yeah. you are going to experience this. You get what I'm saying? So I think the fault is on the mom. What what fault exactly are we talking about? You not, should, not, you should, yeah, what she should have done is mm. make Megan aware, you get what I mean, of, listen, you know, there is racism in the world, there is bigotry in the world. There is stereotypes in the world and those kind of things. You get what I'm saying? Me as a black woman, your mom, this is what I've been through. This is that, 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 that. You get what I'm saying? Like you're supposed to make her aware. My parents made me aware. I'm, mm. I mean, like I'm not a mixed race, so it's, it's not like I have a choice. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? But I think with Megan, and to me, that is the thing with some of these mixed race people, Mm-mm-mm. right? They are able to flip in and flip out. You go, know I mean, depend on how light they are. You go, know I mean, they are able to flip in. They are black today, not too black tomorrow. You go, know I'm saying. So, yeah. so someone like Megan, when I listen to her speak and everything, yeah, it's easy for her to be a chameleon and just move and everything and and get into places that naturally, as a black person, it might be a bit tough. But it's not a fault, though. No, I, what, yeah, no, exactly. because no, people I no, see I'm online they're trying to fault. blame her for it. Like she's just telling her. Do what I say is she's just telling her own truth. Yes. So if she's there saying all my life in the US, people have not treated me this way. That the media, the UK media, is treating me. 
who are we to be like, yo, okay, you're choosing to be black. No, no, no. No, no, no. I agree with you. Mm -hmm. But then once again, it goes back to her parents because, bro, no matter how much you try to camouflage, if you read about the Anglo-Saxon whites, mm. they look at themselves as the elite. Yeah. Right? So no matter, no matter how light-skinned you are, at some point, when you come across them type of people, they will remind you're, you're gonna, you. You're going to get have it. Yeah. You are going to get your nigga wake-up call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And when she got her nigga wake-up call, it was an eye-opener for her. Mm. You get what I'm saying? But my thing with Megan is, once again, two, three, four things can be true, right? I believe that she experienced racism in that house, right? I mean, we are talking about the royal family here. They have a record yeah, yeah, from yeah. colonization and stuff. So I believe that she experienced it. But then I don't want to hear, I don't want to hear the whole thing of, she sacrificed her Hollywood career and she sacrificed her this and this and this for, for this. Bo bollocks. You get what I'm saying? How? How is Bro, it? Bro, bollocks. So we're calling her a D-class D, D star now. Though. Bro, she was a... Z <laughs> Respectfully, she was a Z-class star, bro. No Z. Come bro, on, bro, come on, bro. Nah, like, don't, suits. Don't call Megan bro, Z, bro, suits. That was it. Yeah? yeah. Suits. That was it. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? One of the best things that happened to Megan... And I'm not saying this in a negative way. It's just that I don't like the whole narrative of as if she sacrificed some big thing to be with Prince Harry. Bro, you're talking about Prince Harry. No, obviously. You yeah. are talking about someone from one of the biggest family in the world. Yeah. No, Bro, no, no, that, that fam, alone. Fam, I was seeing a documentary <laughs> on YouTube the other day, yeah? Yeah. Prince Williams's children, those kids at the moment, are worth like each about two to three billion pounds. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> so you, <laughs> bro, let that sink in, bro. I'm like, yeah, but it's the real family we're talking about. Here. Good. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. that whole narrative about you sacrifice this and this and this, bro, if you were still in Hollywood, you are not going to sign how many millions that you just signed with no, Spotify no, for your no, podcast. Nobody say, yeah, no. You are not going to be signing how many millions that you yeah, just yeah, signed yeah, with yeah. Netflix. Yeah. So cut that out. No, no, yeah. but no, she shouldn't cut no, that no, out. No, 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 no. Cut that whole, I sacrifice this and this. And I salute, bro, I salute the chick, yeah, because as a hustler, if you get that type of opportunity, you have to take it. So I salute her. She met the prince. Yeah. And when you listen to all her friends and her mom, right? They will say, oh my God, she called and say, I'm dating Prince Harry. No, it was a big deal. Like, it's a big no, of deal. Of course it is. It is. It's so, Prince Harry. Yeah. Exactly. So I don't like, I don't like the whole thing of I sacrifice. No, you no, know, but, I sacrifice. It, it can no, be you did not sacrifice. No, no it can be a big deal still and her having to sacrifice stuff as well. So come on, because she met Prince Harry doesn't mean she didn't have something going on for her before Fine. that. No, she, no, 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 no. No, no she, she had, wait, no. Did, did she, she have has, going on before no, she that has not? something, just like you and I saying. Yeah. It's just like you and I saying now, yeah, that we, we have something going on for us. Yeah. We have a job, right? Yeah. Now, all of a sudden, mm -hmm. yeah, mm -hmm. the, the, the daughter of some royal family somewhere say, hey, what's up? Da, 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 da. Yeah. Compare this our situation to that. Are you really going to say you sacrifice anything? Of course. Come on, no. Of come course. On, what do you mean? Come on. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You didn't sacrifice. Let's put it in perspective now. The royal family here is, like, like you rightly said, they don't have their own... You, you get told what to do. So, if you're sacrificing, you're sacrificing a free life. No, but she, no, but she didn't know. No, no, no. This is the thing, though. Let's put this in perspective here. She didn't know that. She did not know that before she got into the family. Yeah. She didn't know that. She thought it was going to be like your your Snow White No, but, but she, she knew she wasn't going to be doing her thing again. W yeah, which, that, that which she knew. Yeah. But she didn't know the, you know, obviously the detail. But she know, you know, see this Hollywood business now. Nah. It's done. She knew that before okay. she... Yeah, she knew that. Because yeah. you're not going to you're not gonna be part of there and then still be doing your Nollywood thing. Okay, or cool. Hollywood she, thing. Hollywood. Yeah, she might have known that, yeah, yeah but yeah. she was still ecstatic about the whole thing. So she didn't know how deep it was going to get. 
Yeah. Mind you, in Hollywood, she she might have been seen as this pretty girl and all this kind of shit, and she's getting all this points and all these benefits, right? But then you're going into an element where they look Hollywood. What? They don't. Yeah. They don't look at Hollywood and anything. Yeah, no, they don't. Rate you got me. Yeah. Even the rich white people in this country, they don't even look at them as something. You got me because you're talking about elitism now, right? So she didn't expect what she was gonna get until she got in there. I understand that. Right, mm. but then when you also look at the pecs that comes with the position that you're in, mm -hmm. right? I, bro, I saw was it a couple months ago, years ago? Yeah, she was hanging with with Jay Z and Beyonce and and with Prince Harry, bro. And you could see Jay Jay Z and Beyonce. They were, hey, look, you got what I'm saying? Um, if no, if they... she was Megan from Hollywood, they wouldn't do that. Yeah, yeah. That's my point. The, no. when, you, when you look at the pecs and the lifestyle that comes with what she's getting right now, mm. and once again, she's earned it. She has earned it. I am not saying that she didn't experience what she experienced. Of course she did. You get me? Of, of course she experienced the, the whole racism thing. Of course they made her feel bad. Like, I am not doubting all of that. Yeah, no, never. never. You, you get what I'm saying? But 95% of the world will sacrifice their life for that. Yeah, that. That's what you would think. Like, looking from the outside in. No, no, it's, it's easy to sit, sit here. Me and you see, I'm like, yo, you know what? Maybe, ah, you know, I, I, I want that, you know. Fam, she's but sat, listen, fam, even she little, sat down with Oprah. Hold on, bro. hold on, wait. Hold on, little, like, say for fresh on the boat now, say 90% of the comments we get is bashing, bashing up. Bro, me and you, we had BP, bro. <laughs> 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 me, me, you are Kojo, isn't it? <laughs> we are going to the hospital every day. Every bro. day, bro. Mental health and that, bro. So it's the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine yeah, yeah. that now amplified times that by whatever it is you want to do, and then you see how big it gets. Oh, mad. So that is some sacrifice, bro. I don't care what nobody is saying, but it is some sacrifice. Probably, because probably, you're, you're better off, you know, doing your own little little sitcoms and there, doing chilling, collecting your money, bro. With no people bashing you and calling you, yeah, yeah, this and that. Yeah. Yeah, Imagine. fam, fam, I saw the neighborhood where she was living. Bro, nah, bro. I know how I sound. I know how I sound, yeah. Do <laughs> you know how I sound? <laughs> what? Some of those Nigerian bloggers and everything, yeah, they will post somebody in the UK or in America. The person will say, oh my God, it's so cold here. I am suffering over here. Oh my God, it's yeah. so cold. And then you look, you look in the comments, yeah, you now see... People that are in Nigeria or in Africa in the comments saying, yeah. Switch. You come come yeah. back here. Yeah. More we go there now. Come back. Let me go there. You know <laughs> what I'm saying? So I, I know that that's how I sound. And that's exactly how you, you sound. You know what I'm saying? Guy. Like, you're talking about this and this and this. Bruh! No, no. Well, listen. No, I want to get there first and no, find I out. I know. Yeah, that's what You know what I'm saying? Let me get there first and find no, out. But when you find out, it's not all ple ple pleasant. No, no, no. I agree. It's, the, not, bro, all it's we, not all pleasant. Bro, we saw. That's the reason why Princess Diana broke down. Exactly. That's the reason why she broke down. She did not want. It's part not of a it. joke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I know, I know from the outside when we look in, yeah, mm -hmm. it looks like a joke. But at the end of the day, bro, we can we can only know how it feels until we get there. Yeah, yeah. I still want to get there though. Yeah, no, nah, man, you want to get there, boy. You want to get there on your own terms, like they are now. They're up, 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 but they're not within the whole royal whatever. Yeah, it is. They, bro, they are. Up. But they're still up, innit? What? Yeah, so bro, they are. So up, who's who's up, winning? Bro. They are winning. They're winning. Fam, she came in there and dip, bro. <laughs> <laughs> she came in there and no, dip, no, bro. I, I it's a little hard, though. I sincerely think she she wanted to make it work, though. No, no, no. She no, didn't no. just come yeah. in the restaurant. Back of mind, be like, you know what? Let, I'm just going to come and then, nah, fuck these people. Are there. No, 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 no. I, I think, I think, I think yeah. she, she, she came, she wanted to make it work, yeah. but then obviously it, it is what it is, and work, she yeah. couldn't handle it. And then Harry, as well, seeing, once again, seeing what happened to his mom and everything, he probably was like, nah, yeah. I can't, I can't yeah, stand yeah. here and watch my, you know, because Because they, they were, they were hunting her, bro. I'm not going to lie. The press in the UK, because when the UK here, but all we hear of Megan is the negatives. Absolutely. Obviously in America, it might be different, but over here, bro, I know, I don't see no good. No, 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 no. no. On the press they, about what she's done. Bro, nah, they were I've, killing I've her. never. They were killing her. Even till this day, I've known, I've not seen no good. That's why the whole documentary thing it was uh yeah i'm like yeah come on 
Like these are human beings. They can't be all negative, negative all the time. Absolutely no. I I absolutely enjoyed it. I know that Piers Morgan did not. No, no, definitely but, not. But I absolutely enjoyed it. <laughs> you get me? Shout, shout and, out. and we're waiting for the. the he's got three more, you know, four more. What was it? I think I think there are like a, a couple more coming yeah, out. Yeah, like three more. Cause, so but hey, yeah. we're waiting on that shit. But Netflix should, you know. Listen, bro. Salute to them, man. No, no, they done that. Salute thing. to them and everything, bro. Should we get out of here? No, nah, but we've got, we've got, we've got to jump in the shower and do yeah, our business. Yeah, yeah, and do our business, bro. Fam, you're looking fly already, bro. I've got my, I've got my cash made, bro. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> salute, 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 bro. Nah, salute. Yeah. Listen, man, you, you know what? Yeah. This whole thing that's been going on, yeah, this last couple months and everything, yeah. I honestly, yeah, I, I want to speak to two people, two people that I would love to have a conversation with. Honestly. Yeah. It's a Jewish person, a spy. Mm. Seriously, yeah. A Jewish no, no, person. I, 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 I can tell you, you're you're kind of like a kid in a candy shop, bro. I'm like a kid, bro. Bro, I'm like a kid in the candy shop, <laughs> yeah. bro. You get me? I realize that I do not have no Jewish friends, and I don't know no Jewish people. But I would like to have conversations with with mm. with with them and just get like perspectives and everything. You get what I'm saying? You know. But yeah, I'm like a kid in the candy shop. Yeah, right no, now, I got to think you are. For real. Yeah, you're watching too many James Bond movies. Bro. Nah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> too, many, too, too many, too many Jason Bond movies, bro. <laughs> too many Jason Bond shit, bro. You get what I'm saying? But listen, salute to everyone out there, man. Yeah, for yeah, real. Yeah, and salute yeah. to Kojo, man. Kojo's not here today. You get yeah. me? My man is going Ghana and everything. So, so listen, slide into his DMs and shit, man. You get mm-hmm, me? Tre- mm-hmm. Treat him nice over there, man. For yeah. real. You get me? And also, if you've not subscribed to the channel yet, go on um, YouTube, Fresh of the Boat podcast, leave a like, leave a comment, watch all our videos, share them, tell a friend to tell a friend. Or tell an enemy to tell a friend. Yes, sir. And also, if you want to listen to the audio um, episodes and everything, if you're driving or if you're at work, we don't want you to get sacked. We don't mm-hmm. want you to have an accident to sign. Go on Spotify, Apple Podcast, um, Amazon Podcast, Google, wherever. You get what I'm saying? And search Fresh of the Boat Podcast. You get what I'm saying? And also, we are going to be feeding most of you guys that are in Nigeria right now. We are going to be very soon on the Jalof Radio app. Mm. Jalof Radio app. We, yeah, are in, yeah. we are in communication with them at the moment. You get what I'm saying? But once our episodes start getting up there, you guys will know for everyone that is Nigeria and everything, Jalof Radio app. Go check them out. We are going to be there very, 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 very soon. We're going to be making the app even better. And bigger. And bigger. And bigger. And bigger, 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 big